so right here you'll see the sign that says four five and six and you pull in right there for the pavilions and then just going to drive up here to show you the beach is a little bit further down but it's a great place to have a picnic and this is a great beach actually so we're going to cruise on down here there is five dollars to park up here at the beach so that will be the cost if you want to drive down here uh, pretty small walk, I think. I think you could very easily walk this. And then you'll see on the weekends there's a lot of people that will hang out right here and get in the water. This is not the best part of the beach. There's a lot of people that will hang here. There's also a lot of jet skis that will pull into this area and uh, they'll be cruising around the jet skis here tomorrow I can you can be a hundred percent sure of that so I wonder if they change this to where there's no swimming oh no you can swim still on that side just no parking on the right side but if you look here there's a ton of people out here already enjoying it and this is a Friday we're gonna be here on a Saturday can't wait to spend the day with you guys this guy's fishing Got somebody out here taking their little kayaks out. Lots of people fishing along here. One of the cool things about this park that I was thinking I was remembering correctly, but I wasn't quite sure, is they actually rent these little water trikes and they rent paddle boards and all kinds of really cool things that you can enjoy here in the water. So, see right there, we've got quite a few of those here. And this beach is pretty cool, it actually makes a whole circle, as you can see on the aerial one that we did. And you basically can come in, make a right, and check out the beach. So, I'm going to do one of the little loopy circles here. So I don't get caught up in any more of this traffic than necessary, but you can see parking all to the right and the left. According to the sign on the way in, there is no more parking, but it is uh, spring break at its finest. That's probably why the beaches are so full, but looky there. Tons of people on the beach, Kona ice and all kinds of really cool stuff. All right, see you guys tomorrow. Bye.